Hello YouTubers and Godzilla fans all over the world. Welcome to TT's Toy Talks. Today we're going to check out one of my uh, favorite parts of my uh, Godzilla collection. Uh, now, and I also just want to say right off the bat, I am not a Godzilla expert by any means. So if I get anything wrong or if uh, there's some information I left out, please by all means uh, leave me a comment in the comment section below and, uh, and uh, help, me, help me learn a little bit more here. Uh, what we're going to show off today is a Godzilla nesting doll set, which we've got uh, the box here that it originally came in, and we've got six Godzilla figures. Now, you may have seen this uh, other where you know other places on the internet. Uh, I have come across this uh, nesting doll, uh, these nesting dolls, but I, they typically only have five figures, so they usually just have the uh, first five of these figures, and they're always leaving out this final one. Also a little difference too is that typically uh, they don't come in this box. Uh, they often come in a like clamshell plastic kind of packaging and uh, and so this this is a little different. Uh, this I actually purchased from someone who was uh, living in Japan and they got this uh, while they were there. So you can see everything is for, for the most part in Japanese on the box. Uh, you can see that it was made by Tomi and Capicara and of course uh, Toho, the you know the film studio behind uh, the uh, behind the Godzilla franchise. Uh, but I also I have no idea what any of this says. So if you happen to read Japanese, uh, which I, that's what I'm assuming it is written in, uh, by, you know please let me know what these things say here, because uh, there's quite a bit of, of of writing here. But I really I have no knowledge of what this says. So I would love to find out. Uh, from what I can tell, this was made in 2003, and uh, you can see that up here. They've got the official Godzilla logo there in the 2003, and uh, yeah, lots of lots and lots of writing on this box. And you can see, I believe that this may have been a promotional item. It says uh, not for sale here, so I'm guessing that this was probably a giveaway somewhere uh, in in Japan. And uh, if you have any more information about it, please let me know. I'd love to know where this came from and uh, and how it came to be. All right, so let's take a look, little bit closer look at the figures. Uh, here, I'll just show you. This is a uh, little reference here for how big these guys are. So uh, I would say that the the first Godzilla there is probably probably just about three inches tall, and, uh, and they you know all step down from in size from there. Uh, of course, number one. We have just classic, classic Godzilla. Nice dark green color. I love it. And so, and 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 all these, they're they're like just the most like adorable versions of uh, Godzilla you're ever gonna see. Really, I mean, they're just so uh, cartoony and cute looking. But uh, you can see right down there. Yep, even that right on that bottom there. It says not for sale, 2003. So, but it, we'll take this guy, show him off all around. I love the spikes in the back and everything too. And his little tail hanging down. I don't know about be knocking over any buildings with that little cute tail, but and uh, we got this next one here, which this may be Final Wars Godzilla. I'm not. I'm not exactly sure. Uh, he's a uh, kind of a dark gray color, orange eyes, orange uh, nails and uh, toenails there, claws I should say I suppose. Uh, but he got some ears there. So who is this guy? If you if you know, leave a comment below and give me uh, give me a little bit of information on him. But uh, really really cute. Again, 2003. This one doesn't say the not for sale or not for resale on there. But and then of course this is one of my favorite characters, King Ghidorah. I always loved the three headed dragon, King Ghidorah. Very cool. Yeah, look at that head. Very cool. And uh, next, this is probably another. One. This is one of my top faves too. I think is the Mecha Godzilla. It's really cool. I like his little sharp teeth in there. And again, for being a uh, you know destroying monster here, it's really really cute. Uh, and just you know the the roundness of it just really really sells the adorable factor here. Little tiny feet. All right, and now this next guy, I'm not quite sure who this was. I uh, I kind of initially thought it was going to be it was Mothra, but uh, I don't see any wings on his back there. 
So uh, once again, if you know who this character is, you know, let me know in the comments. He's super, super cute. And uh, and then the teeniest and tiniest of them all. This is, you know, I'm, I, I looks like baby Godzilla to me. I mean, my big old fingers are having a hard time holding this little tiny thing. Look at this. Just adorable. Right? So cute. Let's see. I mean, I'll, I'll give you an idea how big this guy is, too. He's so tiny. Let's see. He is only... Uh, she's about uh, just a little, maybe a little over three quarters of an inch tall. So, so from three inches down on down to three uh, three quarter inches here, and of course they are you know nesting dolls like a typical kind of you know Russian nesting doll. They will pop open. Let's see if I can get it. Right. There we go. And they've got a little little uh, lip there, little you know a couple little spots, little ridges there to to make it a little easier to kind of find how to put them back together. Which is nice, and uh, I'll show you how they all stack up. Let's start from the bottom here and work our way up. All right, so I believe this is Baby Godzilla. Mama, Mama. We'll put him in uh, this guy. Oh, I just, I, it's driving me crazy. Who is this? Tell me. All right, let's see. This one's hard to open up. It's so small. Urgh. I need Godzilla to come and smash this open for me. There we go. Alright, put the little baby inside there. And these things are just adorable. And then put them around the front here. And then we gotta open up good old Mecha Godzilla. Uh -huh. And then King Ghidorah. And then in the final guy right there. Pretty cool. So I feature this also in another Godzilla. I have a uh, Godzilla video where I show off my uh, my full, well, most of my collection, I should I should say. Uh, and I do kind of show these guys off a little bit in there, but I thought we would take a bit, little bit closer look at them. And uh, yeah, those are my uh, Godzilla nesting dolls. I really, really like these. These guys are just a uh, unusual thing to add to the Godzilla collection. So if you get a chance, pick it up. But uh, I think this is the only one that I've ever seen that has all six figures, which is pretty cool. And uh, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you have any questions or comments, and if you can help me fill in the blanks on who some of those guys are, I'd greatly appreciate it. And uh, wherever you go, just watch out for Kaiju. You never know when one's around the corner. <laughs>